of the U.S. Chamber of Commerce and hiring our heroes. Uh, what an honor it is uh, to be included today. And a, a huge thank you to NBC New York, uh, to the New York Football Giants, and, uh, and to NBC News nationally. Uh, in the past two and a half years, uh, the Chamber and Hiring Our Heroes have hosted 550 job fairs for veterans, military spouses, members of the Guard and Reserve, and transitioning service members in all 50 states, the District of Puerto Rico. Almost 20,000 men and women have gotten jobs just from these fairs alone. The way we've been able to do that is through amazing, amazing partners, uh, perhaps none greater than the NBC News uh, family and the affiliates. Uh, I, I do want to call one person who's in the crowd, uh, Val Nicholas. I don't know, Val, if you're here, but Val, right there. Val, Val is, uh, like, like, like myself, Val is a veteran, and, and Val helped NBC News and, and the affiliates and NBC Universal get on board early because Val understood uh, what we at the Chamber uh, understand. Hiring Our Heroes is not a charity. The Chamber of Commerce is the world's largest business federation, and we launched Hiring Our Heroes as a service to our members who are businesses of all sizes across the country because they are looking and seeking constantly to find the most talented men and women they can to be employees. And we feel very strongly that you can't do much better than the folks who have served in uniform for our country. So I want to say thank you to everyone for having us be here today. For, for the folks who are who want to take part in the fair and the job fair that's taking part right after this, follow the band over there, the Hellcats, West Point Zone. Follow them. There will be signs. The fair runs from 11 to 2. Over 100 employers are there, plus VSOs, VA, etc., and, and they're looking to hire. So please take advantage. Thank you so much. All right, so at this time, Michael Jack.